I like sticky notes. Hey guys, welcome to today's No Good Daily Update. Now yesterday you guys may or may not know that I went and saw the movie Please Subscribe about famous YouTubers and their up and coming on YouTube. Which I planned on reviewing today, but then I thought about it. 95% of you guys probably haven't seen the movie yet, and would like to. And you guys can see it on March 23rd. So for the sake of all of you and not spoiling the movie, I've decided to hold off my review of the movie until the movie comes out widely and everyone else can see it. So today I thought of an even better idea to do. Now yesterday and this morning I was in my absolute boredom mode, so I decided to watch a movie. Matrix 2 Reloaded. Yeah. Now myself being a tie aficionado and bow tie kind of guy, I like learning interesting knots so you can do with ties or cool different things you can do to set you apart from the standard wins or not. Now while watching it, I saw this tie and I was so impressed by it and all I wanted to know how to do it. So the first thing I did, Googled it and I found a four image instruction on how to tie the knot. Now because I couldn't find the real tie name, I kind of had to just Google Matrix Reloaded Tie. And you, as you would expect, not a lot of things popped up. So, I kind of pieced it together, and I'm going to show you guys my way of tying it and how I learned it from a couple other people. Now, obviously, for this tutorial, you are going to need a dress shirt like... Eh, this is a little too hip. I guess this will do. Alright, now, this is going to be super, 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 super simple if you can follow along to everything I'm doing, and I will walk you through every single bit of it, and I will hold your hand and cuddle you. Now, you're going to want to make the right side, the fat side, and the left side, the skinny side, which is super easy. You just got to remember, Andreas, everyone else. Andreas, everyone else. Alright, so now you're going to take the fat side and make it about a little bit above your belly button, so it's almost like a bib, so you have a really long left side. Super easy to do, you guys have got this. Now you're going to want to pinch this part right here after you pop your collar because I haven't done that yet. Alright, so now you're going to want to take this side right here, pinch, and you are going to want to fold it over like this and go from behind it and pop it out like that and pop it out and pop it out. Alright, now keep that pinched. It's going to be super hard. No, I'm kidding. Now you are going to want to take this side, go over the left and go behind this while kind of tracking along with it. And you are going to want to pull this through like that. Here we go. Now some cultures like to call this the hentai tie because it looks like an alien penis. That is a lie. No one calls it that. Now you're going to want to take this and you're going to want to go over like that. you got to do it quick because the alien penis will grab your hand if you do not. Now you're going to want to go behind and da -da 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 like a rocket ship is coming right out. Yeah, you see that 3D? Now you already know this is starting to get kind of short, which means you're almost done. Now you're going to want to take this and put it to the left side, left side, which I think is the Crips, right? I'm not quite sure, I'm not familiar in that culture. Now you're going to want to go behind like you would before. Now this is where it gets a little bit unique. You are going to take this and you are going to put it through and put it through that loop you just made going through the back of it. And this is going to look really bad. Alright, so then you're going to tighten that up a little bit. Now this is different than every other knot. You're going to grab here and then just tighten with the fat part. And I can't see how this looks. Judge me accordingly. Now through the magic of mirrors, I went in and adjusted this. Now since my tie was a little folded because I haven't worn this tie in a while, this is a little creased, but you can fix that in any other tie. Now all I did was lower my collar, adjust these, poof out the little folds, and I popped that what was a fold in back out and it looks so much better now, don't you agree? The hentai tie is amazing. Now, I really like this tie for just going to work or something like that, showing off that you know something interesting, how to tie your tie besides that wins or not. I wouldn't wear this to anything where like you can be professionally judged or a first date unless you get really good at this knot and you figure out a more interesting way to do it. Now, if you figure out a more interesting way to do it or how to actually make it scene from scene from the movie, feel free to share it with me. I have no idea how to do it, and this was just my take on it, and I thought it turned out awesome. I would love to see pictures of you guys doing this with any other tie, boy or a girl. I would love to see them, so keep sending those pictures to me and send me pictures of your tie. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my tie tutorial. I love tying ties, and I hope to be doing more in the future and maybe even a bow tie sometime soon because I know everyone loves those red bow ties from Doctor Who. I cannot straighten this for the life of me. My camera must be crooked or my head is lopsided. If you would like to see how to tie other bow ties or any other how-tos, Right down in the bottom, I'm always looking for useless talents to teach people. If I don't know it, I can learn it. Don't forget to check back again tomorrow for another video, and guess what, the day after that, another video, and like, I forget what happens the next day, I think I make more videos. Thanks for watching! Oh god, I can 
finally untie this. So many freaking folds. Oh god. There's more. More. Ah. Uh, 